CES is not just for huge corporations that can afford giant floor displays. It's also a place where a self-financed inventor can show off a device developed for his own use. One booth caught my eye with a product only a computer geek could love. Well, the iInboot Duo is the first true hardware-based SATA boot selector. You now can select different operating systems on your computer on different hard drives without installing any software on your computer. In fact, it's completely operating system agnostic. It'll support any operating system you can install. But what I have here in the system running right now is Linux. As you can see on the front panel, I have a switch that selects which drive you want to boot. If you want to change the other drive, you simply flip the switch and you see the computer has not crashed. There's intelligence in the device that will only swap the drive when it detects the system is rebooting. So what I'm going to do now is go over here and restart. And Linux is shutting down. And if you watch over here, when it gets to the shutdown, you'll see the LED switch. It's now switched. Now the system's going to um, start up in Windows XP. And once it's booted, I'll show you what the other advantage of this product is. So we're now on this, uh, the other hard drive. If I go to this, into the Windows and go to the Disk Manager, as you can see, there's only one partition on this drive, and the other drive is invisible. In fact, the other drive is physically removed from the system. What this means is when you're on one drive, anything you do, crash the system, download viruses, or stuff like that, it physically cannot affect the other drive. So a good application of this would be in the home environment. You can have children on one hard drive and the parents on the other. So when the children are on their hard drive, anything they do can affect the parent's hard drive. In fact, they can't even see it, so they'll have no access to the parent's files. Another good one would be the gamers. You could actually have now one hard drive, which is like a velociraptor, optimized for games, and a second hard drive with all your virus scanners for your school or work environment. Uh, the two drive solution is target price is $99. But I'm hoping to have it in the stores end of this quarter, beginning of next quarter. And I'll also be introducing a four drive product, which will have two options. One is actually a rotary switch to select between four drives. And the other one is a two drive selection that you'll actually be able to do RAID sets. So you can configure RAID sets how you want. If you want a two disk RAID zero and a two disk RAID one, that'd be available. So why exactly did Ken decide the world needed this device? <laughs> well, my daughter did crash my system at one point. And I had to rebuild it. So it was that. And I do semiconductors. And you have to test in different operating systems. And my actual lab machine at work, I have five hard disks in there with five different OSs I have to certify against. And you can't do that with uh, virtualization. It's got to be the true OS. For IEEE Spectrum, I'm Josh Romero.